Human beings are a unique part of creation because they share, most, they share the most basic resources in life, like food, shelter, clothing, and water. When people recognize they're unique, they learn to respect life. People regain their respect for life in society by respecting other people and respecting themselves. Another reason is that human beings are able to tell right from wrong. Stewardship means taking proper care of resource, resources and never treating them only as personal properties. Stewardship of God's creation is an important responsibility for all of us to fulfill. The reason for this is because people can learn the purpose of different aspects of creation in order to care and protect others. The two basic purposes of creation are grow, a strong relationship with God, and God's love created everything and everyone. God wants a relationship with everyone because he wants to know that he wants you to know that he would always be with them. God's creation has not stopped. One of the consequences consequences of God's creation stopping would be that nothing would exist and this would be bad because if nothing existed, we would not exist either. In the book of Genesis in the Bible, stories are religious. God wanted these stories in Genesis written because he wanted us to see how the first human beings were created. The young house creation story was written in 1000 BC. The pie tree creation story was written in 100 BC. They both portray God in different ways. They both portray God in different ways. The young house creation story portrays God through Adam and Eve as a forgiver. The past creation story portrays God as a forgiver despite people disobeying him and people not working as a nation. There are a number of key teachings in the young house creation story. The three most important reasons I feel are that God created the environment so that humans can be happy and so we can all get along. The second teaching is that God created life and he's then he has the right to choose whether something is good or bad and that we should listen to what he says. The last one says that men and women are equal and that God wanted us to become one nation. There are also a number of key teachings in the past to create the stories. The three most important ideas are, I feel are, God created everything that we have today and that we, and that we should appreciate that. Because if there was no such thing as God, then we would be living in a world with nothing. The second reason is that God created heaven and earth so that we can always be with them. And the last one is that God created the commandments to give us rules to follow.